You ready? Let's start. Wide stance with your legs. This is just your warm up. We're going to squat down and reach. So we're gonna warm up for approximately a minute and a half. And as you're squatting, look forward and really reach those arms up. So we have 12 exercises, 40 seconds on the clock, 20 seconds of a rest. You ready to rock? Okay, all right. So give me three more squat reaches, two more, and now hold it up and now bring the arms in towards your head. Take a nice deep breath out, inhale, stretch your arms up, exhale out. One more, take a nice deep breath up, inhale, reach the arms up, exhale, and good. Let's just do a quick stretch over our side and then switch and we're going to start with body weight squats hands at your center wide stance with your legs chest up shoulders or back and let's just do body weight squats keeping your core nice and tight and we're going to do this for 40 seconds so we're on the clock now since this is, this is the first exercise just kind of want you to warm yourself up to it. Abs are tight, squeezing your gluteals at the top of the movement. And now let's start picking up the speed a little bit, just a little bit, and put your hands behind your head. You have to use a little bit more core this way. Good. And as you're squatting, reach those arms up towards the ceiling, keeping your core nice and tight when we're done with this which is now we're going to hit the floor into a wide-legged plank position we are going to do squat tap on your shoulders so the right hand will go to the left shoulder left hand will go to the right shoulder so separating our legs abs are tight and we are on the clock take your time with this 40 seconds and this will bring up your heart rate. So again, we have 12 really good exercises, total body, we're on number two, and then you'll take a quick break, and then you can repeat the sequence. All right, so here, if you're feeling strong this morning, or this afternoon, whenever you're doing this, you can pick up the speed a little bit. Keep your core nice and tight when we're done we are going down to the floor which is now give me a quick child's pose and then get ready to set yourself up for push-ups abs are tight you can do them on the knees or you can do them off the knees just be sure your hands are wider than your shoulders and we're on the clock so 40 seconds here your choice so if you start doing those push-ups in the up position on your toes and you're getting tired, you can always break down to the knees. Just make sure you keep your hips and shoulders in alignment. The benefit of doing them on your knees is that you can go a little deeper to the floor. Exhaling as you are pressing yourself away from the floor. When we're done with these, we are standing up for exercise four, side lunges with a knee lift, which is now. Okay, come on up. We are going to lunge to your right side. I'll show you what it looks like first. We're going to do a nice side lunge and then lift up to a knee. Again, you have 20 seconds to set, to set yourself up. So move to your left a little bit and let's go. Getting nice and deep into the right side. So this is exercise four. When we're done with these, we're gonna hit the floor again for push-ups. Yay! Aren't you excited? <laughs> and lift that knee up and have that nice tall posture. Exercise five is coming. Really keeping 
your left leg nice and straight. Standing up nice and tall. Good. Let's hit the floor. So same as before, back to push-ups. All right, so this is exercise number five. Keep your core nice and tight. Hands underneath the shoulders. We're on the clock. Exhaling as you are pressing up away from the floor. Good. Can you get down a little bit lower? When we're done with this, we do side lunges on the opposite side. Now with your strength, don't go too quickly here. I'd rather have you focus on that full range of motion, fully extending the arms. Keep it going. You're there. Good. Coming up. That was awesome. Move to the right side. All right, so we are going to lunge left. I'll show you what it looks like into that knee lift. Okay, chest up, shoulders are back. We're on lunge, knee. So with this, keep your right leg nice and straight, pulling that left knee up to your abdomen, up to your chest. And when you're pulling that knee, make sure you're standing up nice and tall. How are we doing? Are we good? Yes? All right. <laughs> Chest up, shoulders are back. So this is exercise six. You're halfway there. When we're done with this, we are hitting the floor and we're gonna do a forearm plank. You're there. All right. Forearm plank. Abs are nice and tight. You have your extended legs back. Feet are together. Pull your shoulders. We're on the clock. Down your back. Exercise number seven. Yeah. So some people don't love a forearm plank. And if that's you, you can push yourself up to an extended arm plank. Whatever works best for you. So while we're down here, when we're done with this forearm plank, we're gonna do another set of push-ups. So this is exercise seven. You got this, come on. So next coming up are the push-ups, your third and final in this round. You're there. Give yourself a quick child's pose, doing awesome. Okay, so exercise number eight, I think. <laughs> I lose track, so I'm sorry. Yeah, I apologize. All right, we're on the clock, guys. So your third and final set of push-ups. So this is exercise number eight. When we're done, we're standing back up, and we're just gonna do one more side lunge series, okay, with a plank in between get ready so can you get down a little deeper dropping your hips if you're on those knees if you're on those toes just keep that form pushing your body away from the floor yes you're there nice job okay so with this one Let's move to the left side of your screen. Left side of your screen. I will show you what it looks like. Side lunge, I want you to touch the floor and raise those arms all the way up. We're on. So for people with some tight hips, cough, cough, you know who you are. You are having a challenge here alone, just reaching down to frame that bent leg, that right foot here. So touch down, reach. Excellent. Now if you have the form, you can pick up the speed. What exercise is this? 
<laughs> nine, right? <laughs> 22, <laughs> you're there, good. So let's go back, you did these before, to those plank taps. Come down. Woo, beautiful. All right, wide-legged plank. Shoulders over your wrists, we're on the clock. Plank taps. Exercise number 10. Oh, I know what we can finish with. Really stay strong. Try not to rock too much. You're doing great. When we're done, we stand back up and we do those side lunges, framing that foot, reaching up towards the ceiling. We're there. Okay, coming up. <laughs> Woo. So you're moving to the right side. Let me show you what it looks like again. Framing that left foot, reaching those arms up. All right, so on the second round here, if you have light weights or your third round, if you're doing this a couple times, add them in. But again, keep your form. Keep your form. Framing that left foot on the floor, reaching those arms above your head. Yeah. So we have our 12th exercise to finish. Although I do want to throw in two more. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I do want to do those straight leg lifts. All right, they're so good, we're there. So good for your quadricep muscles. All right, our final exercise of the 12 before the two added bonus, jump squats, okay? Looks like this, nice and light. You can make it as fast as you want, as explosive as you want. Your workout, we're on, it's up to you. I'll show you some modifications here. So we're doing nice, easy, breezy jump squats. If you're really tired, go into body weight quick squats, right? Or remember what we warmed up with, you can go here. But it's about 20 seconds remaining. So let's do it. Go a little faster, jump a little higher. Woo! You guys are doing great. Oh gosh. When we're done, which is now, let's hit the floor. Beautiful. All right, here's your bonus. I do these a lot. Extend your right leg. Left leg is bent. Flexing that right foot, sitting up nice and tall. Let's do little pulses, straight leg raises. So we have this leg, you're right, we're gonna do a quick stretch in the middle. Then we're gonna go into your extended left and then you can repeat, woohoo! 14 exercises, 40 seconds on, 20 seconds of a rest, so good. And we're there. Separate your legs and just bring your chest to your upper thighs. Set yourself up, grabbing your bent right leg, extending your left. How are you doing? Are we good? So we're on, let's do it. This is your last 40 seconds of work and then you repeat it, all right? Really nice, all body workout. So with this, try not to lean back so much, keeping that left leg nice and straight. That left foot is flexed, relax into your shoulders. Woo. 
shoulders are relaxed, you're there. Lean forward, stretch out your backs, take a nice deep breath. And you did it. Woo! 